and action. That's what I say every day to Louis on set of The Manor. And this is why we're here to talk about The Manor, which is in post production. Which means we need great sound composition, uh, great sound design, and fantastic grading so we can deliver you a movie. Whoa, 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 hold on. People watching this, they have no idea what The Manor is. Oh, fair enough. Why don't you tell them? It's your film. Well, it's our film, but you. No, it's my it. film. You, you, you just tell them. No, it's my film. If it's bad. No, no, hang on. I need to get this right, guys. It's my film. If it's bad, it's his film. Well, it's not bad, so it's still It's not my bad, film. so it's his film. Anyway, you know what? Why don't we show them the trailer? Check this out. I found us a nice little gem. It's a manor. It's hiding something pretty special inside. We're gonna be filthy rich. What the hell was that? You never said it was a creepy house. Oh, come on, it's probably just the wind. There's no service in this place. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the manor. Do any of you believe in life after death? Well, we saw something. What did you see? We thought we saw someone. But I don't think we did. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Please, just, just put the knife down. Probably just the wind. No, <laughs> not again. You're telling me you're stuck in a time loop. The first stuck you. Lisa. Creeping behind from every corner of the map, there is nothing I can say that will prepare you for what is to come during darkness. There must be a less painful way to die. What are we going to kill it with? As you can see, there's lots of cool moments. There's different type of characters. We had Kim Spearman, Sarah Alexandra Marks, Louis James, Ray Chang, Stuart Wolf Murray and many others. This film was shot in association with Luke's A. Ferrara, who's also a producer of the film, so big thanks to him. So we have different type of perks. For example, you can come and to one of our VIP screening. If you're interested in the filmmaking process... Of course you're interested. Of course you're interested. In that case, there's a perk to see the original script. There's some special items we're going to give away from set, and you can even have a phone call with Blake and I. Yeah, we're really happy that we'll finish the film and we just need that little bit of money to get the post-production done so we can release it. And when are we going to release it, Louis? Well, we're probably going to enter some uh, film festivals first because we're really excited about the potential this film has, especially on the horror circuit. So hopefully by the end of the year or maybe early 2023. The sooner you help us, the sooner we can get into post-production, get it finished and deliver. What do you say to people who hate horrors? If you hate horrors, you're still gonna love this one because there's more to it than that. There's like Blake said, there's a time loop, there's drama, there's action, there's maybe a bit of romance. What? So, there's romance? I'm just come on, come on, go. Oh, on. yes, there's romance. There's a bit yes, of romance. Yes, so, yes. If you don't like horror, this isn't your typical there's horror. There's sci-fi, there's space, there's there's Star there's Wars. Everything. There's everything. There's everything. Okay, we sold it. That's probably copyright the Star Wars thing, probably can't say that. How do we end this video? I guess we say that's a wrap. You know your mole brows, that you've got two hairs sticking out in between your... Right. It's really pissing me off. Well, please, we'll add a perk so I can Still have there. some beauty treatment. Pluck it. Buy some tweezers and we can take this out. Yeah, he's got no money for tweezers. No, I've got no money for anything. So please, please help us. <laughs>